Hello everybody. I uh, wanted to kind of give you a quick update of the seeds that I started uh, Wednesday. Uh, the heat mat's been doing really good. I'll show you the soil temperature here in just a minute. And uh, if you look, you can see all the condensation that's built up on the inside of that dome. And that really keeps creates a moist environment for the seeds to uh, germinate in. But let me Let me peek in there and let's see what's going on in there. The soil temperature has been staying pretty consistently at about 82 degrees. Uh, as it cools down in the house at night, it drops just a little bit. Uh, the instructions with the uh, seed mat uh, said that it it averages putting the temperature of the the, the uh, seed bed about 10 to 15 degrees warmer than the uh, the air temperature around the uh, seed tray. Uh, we keep our house pretty cool in the uh, winter time to conserve energy and heat and all and uh, so that would be about right it's it's our thermostat usually stays around 68 to 70 so this would be pretty close to accurate uh, uh, by those standards I guess the most exciting thing is I've actually got some seeds that have uh, sprouted uh, most of the broccoli and uh, some of the cabbage uh, were just popping the soil this morning uh, that's pretty good time. I mean, that's, uh, gosh, 40 hours. So a little less than two days uh, since I did this, and uh, and they already started coming up. Well, I'm going to get this put back in the uh, under the grow lights. Uh, I really appreciate y'all watching the video, and I'll keep you updated on uh, any others that uh, start to come up and kind of the process. Uh, I will see you all later.